Hello friends, I'm Kristen Lindhart with The Mindful Heart and I am so glad that you are here. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to cast on your knitting. So grab your knitting needles and let's get started. In order to learn the long-tailed cast on, make sure you've got a ball of yarn and a pair of knitting needles. For children, I always recommend worsted weight yarn and size eight, nine, or 10 bamboo knitting needles. I've got a pair of 10 knitting needles here. Okay, next pick up your yarn and you're going to make a slip knot. So to make a slip knot, you just wrap that yarn into a loop like that and then you're gonna see this yarn here that comes over the top of this bottom yarn. You're gonna put it right through that loop like that and then pull it snug and tight, all right? Then we're gonna slide this right through that loop. So now you've got your first stitch already on your knitting needle. Now, take these two strands of yarn and clamp them down good between your three bottom fingers. And then you're gonna take these like they're, hmm, like maybe they're little pinchers or something and stick them right in between those two strands of yarn and kind of pull them out and see how it makes sort of a diamond shape. Then you're gonna twist those two back like this. So it kind of makes a slingshot. Now, this is a tricky part and if you need to rewatch this video a couple of times, that is okay. So here you see that we've got one, two, three strands that you can see easily from the top view. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go underneath this first strand, pass over the next two strands, and then you're gonna grab that third strand right there and you're gonna pull it through that, um, through those other two strands that kind of make a loop. And then you're gonna Tug it tight and kind of use your two fingers to spread that yarn out again. Now I have a little rhyme that might help you with this. So let's try this again. Here's the little rhyme. Under the first strand, then past the next two, wrap around the third, then pop the yarn through. All right. Now, if you kind of lose your yarn, just grab those two strands with those three fingers, put your first finger and your thumb through those two strands again, pull them apart and bring it down. Okay, let's do that maybe two more times with the poem. Under the first strand, past the next two, wrap around the third, then pop the yarn through. By spreading out those two bottom stitches, you're able to tighten it up. Now bring down that slingshot again, and let's do the poem again. Under the first strand, past the next two. Wrap around the third, then pop the yarn through. And give it a little tighten, a little tighten tug. You don't want it too tight, or else it gets hard to slide back and forth on your needle. But you don't want it too loose either because then it falls off. Hmm, you know what? Let's do that one more time. So get those two strands pinched between your three bottom fingers. Take your pointer finger and your thumb in between those two strands. Spread them apart. Kind of bring it back. Under the first strand, past the next two. Wrap around the third, then pop the yarn through. There you go. That is how you cast on. So you'll cast on however many times your pattern tells you to. Thank you for learning how to cast on with me today. Be sure to stay tuned for more fun videos like this one. I'm Kristen Lindhart, and this is The Mindful Heart.